In this video, we're gonna look at how to create a category and apply it to our products. Categories are great for searching products within the system, as well as being able to report on them. So we're gonna go into inventory, into our categories here. We're gonna create a parent category called clothing. And we're gonna create a subcategory called jacket. Now, if I go back to my categories, I can see that my clothing now has a subcategory of jacket in there. I can also have a subcategory of jacket as well. So maybe I want winter and fall. So if I go back to my categories again, I can see that there's clothing, then jackets, then fall, then winter. So now I'm going to apply that category to some of my products. So I'm going to go over to my inventory. I'm going to search my products. I'm going to search jacket. So I've got four here that popped up. So I'm going to pick my authentic trucker jacket. And you can see that there's no category that's applied right now. I'm going to assign it to my clothing category under jackets. And this one I'm going to select fall. Now I'm going to save changes. If I wanted to apply categories to multiple products, I can do that within quick edit items. So I'm going to go into inventory, into my quick edit items. I'm going to select category as one of the fields. And I'm going to search jacket. So you can see here that I've got four products. We've assigned the jacket category to my authentic trucker jacket, but the rest don't have any categories applied. So I'm going to apply those here. Clothing, jacket, say this one's fall as well. And so is this one. If I change the description of the category, it's going to apply to all those products that I've just applied it to. So I'm going to change clothing to apparel. So I'm going to go back into inventory under categories. I'm going to select the clothing category and change that to apparel. Hit save changes. Now when I go back to inventory, if I go to my quick edit items and I search jacket, it has now changed from clothing to apparel as the parent category for those products. This has been how to create a category and apply it to the products within your Lightspeed retail database. Visit our support page for more videos and how-to articles. Thank you very much.